Hello and welcome to uh, another tutorial. This is going to be a tutorial on a combination lock. Uh, a really simple one too. I've looked at some of the other videos on YouTube and they're all like super complicated to more or less get the same thing that this this attains. It's a uh, fairly simple. I will show it to you how it works here and then I'll go make it on something else or another. Okay, so this is a combination lock I'm using for an adventure map me and my friends are making right now, so more or less okay look. One, two, three, four, and five or one, two, three, and four, that's it. And here's enter. So you click enter to open the door, but Oh, nothing's working. It's not un it's not opening. Crap. What do I do? So more or less the combination for here is up, down, down, up. So we already have it up, so down, down, then up and that would open the door so, uh, so let's show you opens the door and obviously if you have like the wrong combination or something so if I were to go like would not work if I were to any other combination but that combination won't work so um yeah more or less that's uh you know then you can come over here and get in and uh yeah so yeah, let me reset this real quick okay i'm going to go to a another thing and show you again all right that's where i was testing the thing out okay so more or less i'm going to show you how to uh stop it from raining yeah there we go okay i'm going to show you how to do this so make a wall just make it fairly long cuz this isn't this is the most compressed version of that you could do, but it's definitely the most easiest that I've seen on YouTube at least. And I, I figured this one out myself. This isn't accredited to anybody. I'm not stealing anybody's work. And um Okay, so make your door. And uh Obviously I'm not gonna hide this. I'm not gonna make it so you can't see that. Because you, you can figure out how to do that on myself. You can just like wrap it around here. And do it that way, but I'm not gonna do that. So, more or less here, I'm gonna get some uh some of that. Okay. So put a block down that you will recognize from the other side as the uh, block that it is. And this actually isn't long enough, so I'm going to make this just a bit longer. And uh, so yeah. So more or less now we would take uh, uh like that. We do that and now here comes the part. So we what we would do is on the very last one, this is gonna be our enter block, like in the other map. This is four digit this can be as many digits long as you want. Uh but I'm just gonna show you a four digit one, four digit lock passcode. So uh I'm gonna put a repeater in there so I'm sure that it will or actually that's a bit long. So, um, so I'm sure that will make it. So yeah, do that. You don't have to set those anything, so don't worry. Um, now, actually, this is really long, um, but it doesn't matter. It doesn't have to be this far back. It can be a lot shorter. Just make sure that you'll fit everything in here. So put that one on everything. And so okay. This is when you choose what you want your combination to be. For every for every for every um thing that you want down for every lever that you want to uh, f for so uh, how can I explain this um if you want a lever down if you want that to be part of the combination for for that lever to be down you would put a redstone torch on that block and so say I wanted the combination to be this or not sorry if I wanted the combination to be down up down up and then this is the enter key so don't don't worry about that that's completely not that's not part that's just the enter here you know i'm not going to label it so yeah don't worry about that so that's what i would do if i wanted the uh, code to be down up down up i would have a redstone torch there and there so yeah more or less and then you do this you make and and obviously for the ones that you don't have redstone torch at, you just connect it up like normal. 
and uh so now now this is a uh, right now none you have to make them sticky pistons so make connect this uh, connect each one of these to a sticky piston and put a block down so the sticky piston can control it now we are going to dig one one um one block down for each one and uh so like that like like so and um <coughs> More or less, that, sh that should be it. We should be done. Um, and you'll see how this works in a second. So, we have our combination going, right? Right as rain. So, that's our combination. We would flip, flip the enter switch. And, just like clockwork, we uh, our door is open. And uh, we can access what's behind there. So, just as another showing, if you have it wrong this won't work this uh, will not open and you will be stuck but if you do or yeah if you do fix it then it will open and yeah that's more or less it it's rather simple this is probably one of the easiest ones I've seen on I've well, I made this I didn't see it anywhere but it's probably pro probably people figure this out before this isn't that difficult to figure out so yeah more or less that's about it and um please like rate comment subscribe whatever you want to do and thank you very much and goodbye